70 people are under quarantine in Shelby County for possible exposure to the coronavirus. Only one person in Shelby County has tested positive for COVID-19, and we're told that patient is in good condition while being treated in isolation at Baptist Memorial. So let's walk you through the information. Parents with children at Treadwell Middle and Elementary Schools are not playing around. Many wiped their kids down and some even sprayed them with disinfectant spray as they took them home Monday. And we begin tonight with new developments in the coronavirus emergency in America and around the world. President Trump tonight weighing a drastic move. The U.S. now with more than 119,000 cases and more than 2,000 deaths. The president unexpectedly announcing he may issue a two-week quarantine for parts of New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut. The governor tonight calling it a, quote, federal declaration of war on the states. Alex, the health director says we have to go through several incubation uh, processes, which means that we won't be going back to our normal lives within the next two weeks. She strongly believes that. She thinks it's going to be more like two months to a month before we start to see our efforts really working. 135 confirmed cases of COVID-19 in Shelby County at this hour. That number significantly growing in part because private labs are running tests now. But the director says they are seeing a trend. This started with people traveling and then bringing the virus back, spreading it to family and social groups. Yeah, again, she says that aggressive action will keep our community safe and get us back to our normal lives sooner than later. The state of Tennessee has nearly 1,000 confirmed cases of COVID-19. That's according to the State Department of Health. 57 of the state's 95 counties are now reporting at least one case. Yesterday, the state reported 784 cases. This chart you see. Stay home, stay safe, stay healthy. Practice social distancing to protect your family, friends, and the community. Wash your hands regularly. Don't go to public places unless necessary.